Hey guys, welcome again in a new video. As you saw in thumbnail, today's video is dedicated to unlock smartphones, pin pattern, and password. Our uh, this video is completely dedicated to all Oppo and Vivo phones to unlock your smartphones, lock, black pin pattern, and password. Okay, and if you are watching this video, then it means your Oppo or Vivo smartphones has been locked due to forgot pin pattern and password. Oh, so don't worry at all watch this video till the end only then you will be able to unlock your smartphone if my previous video didn't work on your phone and your smartphone could not unlock then don't worry at all watch this video till the end only then your smartphone will be unlocked 100% definitely further in this video I will also tell you why sometimes the method of unlocking don't work before revealing this method there are some important things that you will have to do with your phone the first thing is that your phone should be charged at least 30% otherwise whatever data you have in your phone can be deleted. So before starting this method at least you should charge your phone 30% or else you can charge your phone at the time of use this unlocking method. One, most, uh, one of the most important thing that I would also like to tell you that this method updates every month. So if your phone is not unlocked with this trick then take help of my upcoming or older videos and for this you will have to subscribe to the channel and if your phone is unlocked with the help of this video then do the like this video this give us incredible to make the next videos first of all whenever your phone is locked you should not worry and work with a cool mind watch this video till then only then you will be able to unlock your mobile by fully learning the method mentioning in it and applying it to your locked smartphone as you saw my friend my phone has been locked due to pattern lock and i have forgotten this uh, pattern lock so i will unlock this phone with the master unlocking method so firstly you can uh, you uh, see here this method is known as uh, offline unlocking method so firstly all type of network like telecommunication network and wi-fi network will be closed before using this unlocking method now you can see there is a wi-fi network is showing in my phone firstly i will have to close this wi-fi network so firstly i will have to slide my phone downside like this now you can see here there is an option of a airplane mode or it's also known as like flight mode so simply you will have to activate this mode to close the all network like telecommunication network and wi-fi network so i'm going to activate this mode flight mode now you can see my wi-fi network has been closed now i i'm going to close all the background running, running application to go to the master unlocking method or engineers mode because to unlock your phone by this method your all the background running application should be closed okay so generally it is not possible to close the background running application when your phone is locked so there are some secret codes which generated by the service center to close the running application when your phone is locked and this secret code generally updates within two or three days okay so what you have to do simply you will have to go with the emergency call option and when you will click on emergency call option your dialing pad will be appeared on your phone now the secret code what i am going to give you you will have to fit this secret code in this dialing pad and recent secret code is a star you can take also as a screenshot a star triple zero star double nine then sorry star double nine then a star six three two eight then has after fitting this secret code you will have to call on this secret code when you will call on this secret code you will get a pop-up of a call field but you will have to ignore this pop-up with the ok button at the first time and you will have to do this process same three times continuously after doing this process three times it means your all the background running application are closed now now your phone is ready to go with the engineers mode or master unlocking method so simply what you have to do after this after this you will have to clear your call log like this now i am going to give you a ussd code which is used to reach to the engineers mode or master unlocking mode okay and this ussd code is star has a double nine then has after uh, dialing star has a double nine and has you will reach to a new page like this that is engineers mode or it's also known as master unlocking mode now you can see here there are lots of options on this page but you can see here there is an option of a software version at the fifth number so now you will have to click on this option when you will click on this option you will reach to a new page and you will also get a lots of option on a new page but you can see here there is an option of an android version at the second number and here my phone's android version is 12 it may be possible your phone will be showing your android version 13 or android version 10 or android version 11 so don't worry uh, if your phone is showing here android version 10 it means you will have to click on this android version option 10 time if your phone is showing here android version 13 it means you will have to click on this android version 13 time but here my phone is showing here android version 12 it means i will have to click on this android version 12 time like this 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 and 12 
Now the first step of unlocking method has been done. After doing this method, you will have to go with the back button and when you will uh, click on back button, you will reach to the previous page and you will also get an another option above the software version that is manual test option. Now you will have to click on this manual test option and when you will click on this option, uh, you will reach to a new page that is assembly test project. You will also get a three type of option on this page you can see here but you don't have to go with any option on this page simply you will have to slide your phone right side like this until you reach to the option of a other now you can see here at the end of the space the other option has been appeared on my phone's display and you will also get a five type of option on this page you can see here you can see here at the fourth number there is an option of a database version okay now you uh, it may be possible your phone will be showing here main board version but both the option have the same function but the different name so don't worry about the name you will have to simply click on this option 11 time continuously like this one two three four five six seven eight nine ten and eleven now the second step of your unlocking method has been done now you can see here there is an option of a read write important lock test at the second number now you will have to go with this option and when you will click on this option like this you will get a new pop-up like confirm pop-up okay but you don't have to confirm it you will have to cancel this at the first time and again at the second time you will have to do the same and again at the third time you will have to do the same but when you click on the fourth time on read write important lock test now at the fourth time you will have to confirm this with the ok button and when you will click on ok button uh, it means your all the forgotten pin pattern and passwords are on reconstruction mode now your phone is ready to go with the new pin pattern and password locks okay now the very last step what i am going to give you is most important okay and if you uh, skipped any step it means your phone is not going to unlock it means you will have to watch this video again okay so watch every step properly and follow the every step properly with your locked smartphone okay now at the last step you will have to simply slide your phone left side like this and you will have to reach to the page of a device debugging page you can see here there is a page has been appeared of a device debugging page you can see here and there are also lots of options you can see here on this page but uh, you can see here there is an option of a sensor self test and calibration option at the sixth number you can see here now you will have to go with this sensor self test and calibration option so when you will click on this sensor self test and calibration option you will reach to a new page like this there is a page of a operation not started or both both the option is showing here operation not started okay simply you will have to start this operation by clicking on this option until you get a single test passed message you will have to click on all those options if your phone is showing here three option it means you will have to click all the three options until you get a single test passed message now you can see here i am going to start this operation test has been started the second option test has been started again i will have to click on this option until i get a single test pass message now my friend you can see here a single test passed message has been appeared on my phone's display it means my phone has been completely unlocked now i don't have to do anything with my phone now i will have to check whether my phone has been unlocked or not so you can see here there is an option of a home button at the bottom of the phone you can see here so simply i will have to check whether my phone has been unlocked or not okay so simply simply you will have to go with the home button here so my friend you can see here my phone has been completely unlocked and all the application and the, all the data which were in my phone as it is as in my phone it means this trick this uh, unlocking method really works okay and if your phone is unlocked with this trick then do the like this video this give us encouragement to make the this type of next videos thank you so much see you in the next video with the next unlocking method